The Center Township Constable is explaining what happened inside the Township Courtroom on Monday morning. It's the first time Constable Denise Paul Hatch has talked publicly about Monday's incident. She talked to News 8's government reporter Garrett Berquist. Hatch tells me the confrontation happened because the Township Court Manager had been serving papers despite not being a Deputy Constable. Monday was the first day in about two weeks Hatch provided full constable service. That followed a dispute over police radio use. Hatch and her deputies say they have evidence court manager Richard Watson was serving papers without authority to do so. I asked him and he said no. He said it a number of times, I am not I am not a deputy. I have not been deputized. Okay. But but you have copies of papers that he has served claiming that he was? He yes. I also have copies of him receiving a check from the judge uh, by statute. My fees are collected through the judge, it's $15. He's also collecting my fees as a constable. I asked Hatch for copies of those papers. She says she can't release them because they're part of her investigation. Deputy Kofi Amituyona says he arrested Watson for impersonating a law enforcement officer. He refused, so we had to hold his hands and try to place the handcuff and secure and restrain him. And he fought us a little bit. At that point, uh, a lot of the employees or the security staff, they all burst into the hallway and started a whole scene. This video obtained by News 8 shows what happened next. Deputies at the Marion County Jail turned the constables away when they arrived. My whole thing, frustration is we made an arrest. We are here to bring him in for booking. Are you telling us no? We need clarifications. And he will not give us any specific answer or reasoning why. The sheriff's office tells me it can only jail those who have been arrested by people who have the proper authority. On October 17th, small claims court judge Brenda Roper issued an order declaring Hatch unable to perform her duties. Watson and Hardin both were released. They don't face any charges. The order is public record, but Hatch says she never received a copy. She says nobody ever deputized Watson under the order. It was premature. Um, first of all, the judge should recognize it was done for public safety. There was no, the emergency was that we didn't have our radios and it was a matter of, it was a matter of public safety and I expressed that to her. I called Judge Roper's office multiple times to ask for comment for this story. She never responded. Hatch tells me she considers the criticism directed at her, including over Monday's arrests, to be politically motivated. At the Center Township offices, I'm Garrett Bergquist for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and like us on Facebook.